not going to end well. Just keep your wits about you. Sigurd, is there a problem? We'll go see Tomna. Just the two of us. Ivar and Uba will wait here. Better if Tomna thinks we've come alone. The truth is, I don't think any of us can stop Ivar from cleaving her head open. It's all he was spewing the whole way over here. Right. Shall we? We'll return shortly. A small fortune for whoever sent Tona to hell. I'll hold you to that. From what I overheard in Repton, the brothers had an arrangement with Tona. What happened? She's a mercenary. Uba used her for man and information. But that relationship soured now that Burgret is all but defeated. From what I heard, Tona has a hunger for two things. Soft silver and a stern hunt. Neither of which earns you true loyalty. If she can't be trusted, what use is she? That is for us to find out. We may be able to satisfy her. And if we can't? Eva did tell you to bring your axe. And here they are, as expected. If she takes a liking to you, keep talking. She's more your type, I think. No, no. This is your challenge. Come now. Don't drag your feet. We will attack on sight here. Sigurd, what brings you strolling into my camp this brisk day? I suspect you already know. Yes. <laughs> the embers on the air betray you. And yet, if you are here talking to me, King Burgeret remains at large. And who are you, lovely dove? Want to perch your ass on my lap? Not interested. And why not? I've been told I have a rather expert tongue. Only good for yawping, I see. <laughs> Enough blabbering. You know why we're here. Where is King Burgeret? That is what you want. And what makes you think I have the slightest idea? We found letters. Records of trade. The two of you have a history. What can I say? The king pays well for my services. If only I could say the same for those two Ragnarsson clots. You're dealing with me now, and I want to know what you know. Name your price. Very well. I could use another cow. And you can cover the cost. You take me for a fool. I take you for desperate beggars. I can smell it on you like dung heap. Now that's my price. What say you? You heard me the first time. But I'll get what I need one way or another. No, no. You have shot your chance. And if you show your faces around here once more, I will tear you limb from limb. Well, that is not the result I was hoping for. I hope you have another idea. Tona keeps a close eye on whoever she deals with. If Burgred is keeping records, so is she. Somewhere behind those walls. See what you can find. I'll go back to the brothers. Keep those gates locked. If they come within a foot of here, kill them! See you, old friend.
Tona's house. I might find something useful there. to get on the other side. Must be blocked from the other side. Clever. Let's see what secrets you keep, Tona. This might be something. Looks like Burgred once paid Tona to steer the Ragnar sons away from two areas. Burgred's private hunts, perhaps. He could be at either one. Shouldn't have been so greedy, Tona. Right, back to the brothers. Eivor, tell us you learned something. Let Estra and Templebroth fought. What do you know about them? Hmm. Lederchester is a large village. And Templebroch, it's an old military fort. Not much else. Burkret could be at either one. We should check both as soon as possible. And what do we do with Tona? I would bet the sweat off my sack she's writing to Burkred now, offering silver for a warning about us. Let me worry about that. We should get moving, Drinkit. I can take the fortress of Templebroch. I will join you, Sigurd. That leaves me led the Chester, then. All by my fucking lonesome. 
And your friend, brother. Maybe Eivor dares to be called that. Go on ahead. I'll catch up with all of you soon. Good timing. We would have stormed the place without you. What have you seen? Soldiers aplenty, wagons going in and out. That weasel Borgred is here, I'm sure of it. The bathhouse there and that church, see? I sent a scout to check them both. Should be back at any moment now. Did you see Uba and Sigurd in Templarbrach? No. And if Burgred is hiding here, I won't have to. There is a lot we would not have to do if we stuck to killing kings. Thanks to my brother, now we are into making them. Abba has his way and you have yours. That much is clear. I'm not here to play favorites. No. You are here to make your mark. I know what it means to be a young Dranger. You think of glory and destiny. You've got me all figured out. I know your type, Wolfkist. But me, I am not looking as far into the future as you. Time's up for your scout, I'd say. He's either dead or run off. Give him a chance. Can't risk them seeing us and Burkrit slipping away again. You stay here and wait for your scout. I'm going in.
bathhouse. We need to find a way inside. Hey, who are you? Die! We're to secure our food stores first, lay off Frith's orders. <laughs> lay off Frith's orders? Bah! The King's grown tired of them, you know. That's what all the men are saying. Tired? How do you mean? Are you blind? He questions Burgrid's orders every chance he gets. That's done ever since the Danes showed up. By the hall of goods, they've hidden away. Ugh. <sighs> 
crates full of food and supplies. Burgret's not giving up without a fight. Have you lost your mind? I feared you were one of them. Keep quiet. What are you doing here? I'm... I was looking for Burgred. You are Evi's scout. I hoped I might find Burgred myself and talk him into surrendering. But he's not in Lederchester. How can you be sure? Leofrith passed this way with some men. I eavesdropped. It seems they're only stockpiling food here. But he did say something of interest. Gave orders to send more men to Burgred's wife. The Lady Arvilsmith. She's in Templebro. She would know where Burgred's hiding. Do you hear that? The sounds of battle. Eva. Let's get you out of here now. Where are you going? I know my way around. We'll go through the market. This way. I'll kill you! <laughs> Are you hurt? Speak up. I... I don't think so. My god. I didn't want it to come to this. It would have killed you, Chilbert. You had no choice. Now don't move. Morgan! Where is your king, Saxon? Where is he? Lord our Father, grant me salvation. When does their god find the time to answer so much mumbling and whimpering? You're reckless, Ivar. Cheobed could have been killed. 
Who am I to stand in the light of a boy searching for his boss? Don't excuse yourself. You enjoy this too much. Stop. It wasn't Eva who sent me. I sent myself. Have caution, boy. Until your father is crowned your Mercia's enemy, not its champion. You understand? I understand. Good. Now return to Repton and remain there until we call. Will you not stay, Wolfkist? There is no king, but we have corpses to loot. Burgred's lady Athelsweth is in Templebroth. I'm going to find out what she knows. Anything again. We've told you everything. What? Ava, there you are. What's with the prisoners? Man from the fortress, out on patrol. We squeeze them. Burger's not here. It's his queen they're guarding. Others with. We must have separated off to Tomworth. I heard as much from Chaelbert in Lerichester. Chaelbert? What was he doing there? Ivar. Too long a tale for now, but he's fine. I send him to Repton. What's the plan here? It won't be long before someone comes looking for these men. We need to get inside and find Alice with. Capture a queen to find a king. It might work. Only one way to find out. See if you can get anything more out of them. Me and Aver will take care of fetching Alice with. Oh, then guide you. Saxons won't welcome us through the front door. We could find a quiet way in, or we can take your long ship. I'm beside you either way. Dreamt of this day. Fortification! Oh. Oh. Let's go, Viking! Look there! Enemy camp, Eivor! Sail! Sigrid! Sigrid!
show me.
You three, scurry. Lady Athelswith, I see Burgret has done his best to hide you away. But what is lost must always be found. Let my handmaidens walk free of this place. They have nothing to do with our quarrel. You hear that, Aver? Noble. Selfless. This is the sword you must strike a bargain with. A woman of quality. We seek only your king, lady. Tell us where Burgred hides, and we will leave without an ounce of blood spilled. Please, I... I don't... I don't know. Effective, Sigurd. She is only naive to her present danger, but she will soon understand. Wait. Those are the hands of one who washes linens. A servant. She is a decoy. Watch the handmaidens. I'll follow Athels with. Best battle sweat blow. No paradise where you're going. Get back here and face me. God's justice awaits, coward. and will send you all to hell. Oh, quite clever, your ladyship. You're certainly making us work for it. Keep your hands off me, pagan! Have you lost your sense of hospitality? I regret asking. Let me go! I demand it! After what you put me through, I would have to be mad. Do you understand what you're doing, pagan? I am the Lady of Mercia! You're wasting your time. I w <sighs> Lady Otherswith, you have seen better days. God will sear your soul, heathen, if he can find it. Why the catch, Aver? She is as much a poet as you. Where's my Catelyn? What have you done with her? Your handmaiden, you mean? The brave one, dressed in royal finery? Season change with the others. I'll take them back to Tamworth. Get them talking. If she has so much as a scratch on her... I will inform Cheowulf. He might have some ideas on how to get through to her. I will meet you there. Sigurd, what about these prisoners? We've got what we need. Let them go. My thanks. God bless you.
Look! Soldiers dug in over there! Your turn. She won't talk to me. You've exhausted my friend Abba here, but I'm wide awake. Maybe tell me where Burkett's hiding and let him rest happy. Never. Stone-faced and tight-lipped, all for a king who hides like a cowardly bull. Too scared to protect his family and his people. Thirsty? <laughs> my husband does what he must for Mercia. How could he do otherwise? ...knowing that even his closest friends could betray him. Give that traitor Cheowulf my message. He may win this earthly battle, but the devil has won the war for his soul. I don't care how you feel about Cheowulf, but he will be king. It's only a matter of when. Borgred is king. Elected by the Witten and anointed by God. My lady, I know what the losing side looks like, and you're on it. We've taken Repton, Tamworth, now Templebroch, and Lerichester. With each victory, your hope for peace recedes. Yet Borgred has what you do not. The loyalty of his people. Good men. Faithful men. Who? The Thanes and Cheols of Mercia? No, no. Only Leofrith remains loyal, and he too will fall. Yes. Goodly Leofrith. He will die defending his king. And win or lose, he will send a hundred more of you to hell. Eivor, your ladyship, do not mind me. Only here to count my spoils. Oh, God! Pigs have to eat, my lady. The trouble is, it takes a lot to sate their hunger. Only a matter of time before they finish those and sniff around for fresher meat. And the smell of pig shit after this? Ooh. My... my god! Get me out of here! Please! Talk now, and we'll draw you a nice warm bath. You... You are asking me to betray my husband. How can I do that? If you don't, you will betray countless others. In legend, you may be remembered as the king and queen who abandoned their kingdom in its darkest hour. But there will be peace. This is Cheol's promise, and it will be honored. You have my word. Does the caged bird sing? Burgred is hiding in an old crypt to the south. ...where the Alni and Aero Rivers join. A crypt? Now tell me this is not a sign from the gods. It's a long way to carry a king. The three of you must clear a path back to Tamworth. Where can we meet? Bring him to the bridge at Venonus. It's a straight line through. We'll deal with any trouble there. The heads were a nice touch. I'm not one for spectacle, but it got her talking. Spectacle? That's just me.
Take everything! Jesus, what's happening? down here. Must be getting close. No! No, no, no! It can't be! Stay back! That's a bread knife, my lord. Do you mean to batter me? Stay back! Back, I say! I'll fight you! If you insist. 
You'll have to kill me. Luckily for you, it won't come to that. This kingdom is mine. Mine! <laughs> Time to go, my lord. We're late for the crowning ceremony. There! I want that dame cleaved and butchered! Tona. Help! You crossed me, lovely dove. Did you think I wouldn't find out? I'll send you back to the Ragnar Sons in pieces. Our fates are leave together, lovely dove. Hell watches over you now, lovely dove. That settles that. Ah! Ah! Get me off this thing! Think you've won? You haven't. Lyafris, I, I sent him away with orders to destroy you. Quiet. The mess you're in, you don't know the half of it. You're a blight on this world. The whole lot of you. A rancid disease. You don't deserve mercy. To the victor, the spoils, my lord. You must win Mercia to deserve her. Here we are. You familiar? No! No, you...
change has come, Burgred. All that remains is a coronation. A witten with the Lords of Mercia. Burgred, my love! My lady, are you injured? Did they hurt you? No, no. I'm fine. Move along, Lord. Your king awaits. Your death will come, Danes. Your end was writ the moment you came for me. I have made damn sure of that. The Zealots will know your name soon enough. No matter where you are or how far you travel, they will hunt you down. Enough of that, you squeaking sparrow. Let my brother be the lunatic of Tamworth. Zalit? What does he mean? Ignore him. Desperate pleas and prophecies, nothing more. Walk with me, Wolfkist. We have some time before the ceremony. Where to? Nowhere in particular. I only want to celebrate. Didn't think you were the type. You have drawn a dark conclusion about me, haven't you? That is all well and good. I've drawn some about you as well. Are you leading a land to slaughter? See what I mean? Dark. Too dark. You there! Get lost! Sit down. I know I have been a cock. But you are a good fighter. I respect that. Let it be said that Ivar the Boneless considers Eivor a friend. Who calls you boneless? Some background I killed in Hibernia. Used his guts to shine my spear. Called me boneless because I move like a reed in the wind. Not because you're always too drunk to plow? Valhalla. That is where I am bound. I can smell the blood and taste the mead. I will sit beside the High One with my axe in hand. A fitting end for Reknason. You would think, eh? Me, Hafton. We will be there. But Uba... No. I do not think we are chasing the same victory. Not anymore. What does Abba want? To grow old and fat on a farm somewhere with little Ubers to chase about. He wants an heir. It's a common dream. Not for a warrior. Not for Drengir like us. He was different before. But this place, England... It softened him. What was he like before? Like me. Ferocious. Wild. With respect, I don't think anyone is like you. If that is a compliment, I missed it. All I mean to say is, things were easier some time ago. If it bothers you so much, why not strike out on your own? Because he is my brother. I love him. And I will do what it takes to drag him back around to my way of thinking. We are warriors. All. And that is to the death. did myself again. <sighs> did I miss the crowning?
Where is my son? We sent word to Repton, but we've had no word, Lord. I suggest we carry on. You sought me out, old friend. And here I am, standing before the throne from which I reigned not long ago. You stand before us to accept this Witten's unanimous decision. That you are unfit to rule, and are hereby deposed. We demand the abdication of your kingdom and your crown to Thane Chairwolf. Mercia has spoken, Lord. The crown. Is that you, old friend? Ah, yes, I see it now. Forgive me. The robes of righteousness sit so loosely upon your shoulders. If the heavens mismark me as king, forgive its obscuring light. Amen. Now, where is my crown? Forgive my nerves. Here I am, an upright man who never once learned how to bend the knee. And yet, I shall try. Ah! How simple it is. How easy to kneel without fear and feeling. He's mocking you, man. I'd kill the fucker. Worry not, Dane. I shall resign this crown and this pagan-infested kingdom and the favors of these two-faced men. But I will do so on my terms. My demands are simple. Firstly, you must... <laughs> you fool. Look around you. You have no leverage here. Plead for your life. For it is the only thing these men will grant you. Yes. Yes. Forgive me, I... I... Do not harm me, I beg of you. Please, I'll go anywhere. Here, I, 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 I resign it, here. Take this lord and his wife to Rome. He is hereby exiled, never to return. The Witten recognizes King Chairwolf of Mercia. Second of his name, a just king, a merciful king. God save the king! He better be worth all this trouble. Mercy and soldiers marching on Repton! Leofrid, loyal to the ugly and the bastard. Gather what men you have and split them between the north and south gates. That should divide his forces. Cheobert is there. Eivor, you must save my son. You'll come through this, I promise. I will stay here with Cheowulf. Go. <laughs> <laughs> 